Besides celebrating Queen Elizabeth's Platinum Jubilee this week, there's another royal cause for celebration, Lily Bet's first birthday. Prince Harry and his wife, Meghan Markle, are traveling to the UK this week with their two children, Archie and Lily Bet, to take part in the special four-day weekend in honor of the Queen's record-breaking 70 years on the throne. The trip marks the first time Lily will meet any of her royal relatives in person, and her birthday will also be right in the middle of the celebrations on Saturday, June 4th. The toddler in the Queen meeting is definitely special, as Lily is named after her great-grandmother, whose childhood nickname was Lilybet. The news that the family of four would travel to the UK for this special celebration comes after Harry told today's Hoda Kotb in April that he was not sure if his family would make it back for the festivities, citing ongoing security issues. Even though plans changed and the Duke and Duchess have made arrangements to reconnect with the royals for the occasion, they will not stand on the balcony with the monarch for the trooping of the color as they have in previous years. The Queen has decided this year's traditional trooping the color balcony appearance on Thursday, 2nd June will be limited to Her Majesty and those members of the royal family who are currently undertaking official public duties on behalf of the Queen, a Buckingham Palace spokesperson told NBC News. Harry and Meghan stepped back from their roles as senior working members of the royal family in 2020 and moved to Meghan's home state of California. Despite ongoing speculation that there is still a rift in the family, the couple met with the Queen last month ahead of the Invictus Games, which were held in Europe. The Daily Mail's Charlie Langston shared with Access Hollywood in April why she believes this was a significant move. This was really an opportunity for a lot of them to kind of come together, sit down behind closed doors, and really just work on starting to mend all of the rifts that have taken place in recent months and recent years. We do understand that Prince Charles was incredibly hurt by some of the things that Harry said in that Oprah interview. And the hope is that this meeting served as an opportunity for them to talk some of those things out and start to move forward.